I'm TV people! <laughs> spin, spin, sugar baby! So we are going to do some enabling works. So what are enabling works, John? Enabling works are the start of work so other trades and other contractors can come in and start their work. So it's the starting works that we're doing on this particular project. And what we're going to be doing, tickling sticks here, we're going to be fitting roller shutter doors inside this bit here, this bay, and then also this bay here. Tickling sticks never wrong, folks. And we are going to be creating some ramps from there so we can get some uh, heavy machinery in and out with some drop curbs. So drop curbs are these bits here that come down. So we'll be adjusting all this so it falls away. We'll be changing that manhole top there for an industrial strength one because of the weight of the, the machinery that's going to be coming in and out along there. We will be also digging a trench. Oh, spin it round. Digging a trench from here in the corner because we're going to put what's called a totem in, which is like a big slab of concrete. So they can put a sign on there so we can have flashing lights to show who they are and advertise the business. And then we'll be also taking another trench to where the entrance is here for the electric gates. So we'll be putting the uh, data cables in and we will also be putting in the mains cables and look at the size of this, folks. It's massive. Um, other works we'll be doing. So one of the, I won't say slight complications that we've got is if we stand back here and look. So because this is a steel portal framed building, which is basically these big steels there that go across into the roof space. And then it's, it's a, a little bit of block work and brick work there is this brace here, this, this X behind me, X marks a spot, people. That brace still needs to be attached. So we need to take that out and move it. The problems we've got is this bay here is going to be a roller shutter door. This bay here is going to be a roller shutter door where the brace is, which means the brace needs to be moved. So we could try and remove the brace and put it into this bay. The problem is, is this part here comes down going to fall down here so we've got a bit of a problem in terms of where the corner brace comes down so it's going to go just follow my finger up there like that it's going to it's going to want welding cutting out and welding onto this piece of steel here tickle tickle which means we've got to knock a hole out down there, but then that means the welder's going to be welding behind where the gas pipe is, which is that, and also the mains, and you've also got insulation inside there. So, bit of a problem we found. There's always a solution. Maybe the solution is that we'll have a structural engineer to redesign something completely different so that it still does the same job, but it's not in the way. Uh, what else are we doing? <clears throat> so other things we're doing is we've got some existing drainage inside the floor. We're going to be cutting those out and take, getting rid of them. We're going to be putting some new drainage in there for some new toilets. We're going to be putting a new water main in there again for some toilets. Um, cutouts. So these windows here, we're going to be creating some more windows there and potentially there as well. And then all this is going to have a complete mezzanine floor in. It's going to have a full office shop fit. I'm just going to look fantastic, folks. And I said I was going to be quick. That's it, me. Like the SAS, in and out. So just a little bit of a little bit of enabling works. See you later, folks. Mwah.